Hello pumpkins, welcome back to another video. I don't know why I always sing when I say to another video, but you know what? Welcome. Um, hi if you're new here, my name is Chia and today I am bringing you guys a very highly requested video and that my love is, well my love, I can say my pumpkin, is a holiday haul and I'm so excited if you saw my last video which was on Wednesday um, you would have seen me and Ella and Molly went shopping for our holiday bits just like our little bits that we need to get in the shops um, because some to be honest with you, like, most of my outfits, all the, I think pretty much all of my outfits are literally from online. So, it's more just sort of, like, little bits and bobs that I need, like, toiletries, bikinis, that sort of thing. Um, so if you haven't watched that video, go and watch it now. I will link it in the description box. Um, but I had so many messages on Instagram going, Chia, can you film a haul? Please film a haul. Please show what you got. Please film a haul. Do you really think... That I would not show you what I got. I love showing you this sort of thing. And this is the beginning of the holiday content guys. That was the first video leading up to my holiday. And yes I don't go on holiday till sort of middle to end of May. But because I've not been on holiday like out of England since 2019. It is necessary that I literally milk this holiday. And I create so much content for you guys. And I start talking about it really early. Because I'm so excited as you can imagine. Um, little disclaimer for this video. Basically my hair today is freshly washed. Um, I used the most unreal hair mask on it last night. It's a new L'Oreal Hyaluronic Acid. It's in like the purple tub. Insane. Um, so I have used that so my hair's like really soft and fluffy so I'm literally just putting it up in this clip but it keeps falling down where it's so soft so you're just going to have to bear with. Sometimes we have bad makeup days, sometimes we have bad hair days, sometimes it's both. Um, luckily my makeup looks alright today so well <laughs> until I watch this video back and I'm like Chia stop trying to do eyeliner um but yeah i mean that oh, it's just it keeps falling out because my hair's so soft that'll have to do um so i went to primark i went to super drug there's a lot in there as you can see um and i also had two deliveries this week so i thought i might as well include that because why not um, from Opoly and Pretty Little Things. So I will show you those at the end as well. Um, but what should I start off with? Should I start with Superdrug? Or Primark? Let's start off with Primark. I feel like that's the most exciting one. So if you are new to my channel and you don't know, I'm going on holiday to Malta for Malta Weekender with Bring Me The Horizon. So I'm going to be in the sun with my, a few of my favourite bands. So... We need to look good, you know what I mean. So we are going to start off with something that I actually... I'm so, like, happy that I've got. I've not stopped thinking about it. And I can't remember it was Ella and Molly that was like, Oh my God, Chia, you need that bag. And I was like, ah, yes, I do. Um, So, obviously, you guys know I love my baby pink and my black. My favourite colour combo ever. A baby... Well, it's kind of like a candy pink. Is it candy pink? It's like a bubblegum baby pale. I don't know. It's like a cute shade of pink. Um, bum bag with the black and silver detailing. I wear silver jewellery. So this is literally perfect though. Um, and obviously black. And when they showed me this. I can't remember who it was. But Ella or Molly. Whoever it was. I love it so much. Might have been both. Um, were like you need this. I actually do. Like I have a black bum bag that I'm going to take me. Because it's kind of like festival during the day as well so I'm, I'm not gonna wanna like I'm not gonna like hold a bag a bum bag is actually perfect and I'm gonna use this so much regardless of Malta so I'm literally so excited um so it's obviously from Primark it was eight pound I think yeah eight pound um and obviously it will go like across me um but you can like change the strap length and everything like that but I honestly love it so much by the way I've had a cold this week hence why I sound a bit the um but i absolutely love this bag dearly and um, this is going to be a new staple for me it is 
literally so cute and has so much space you've got the main pocket which is huge because i'm going to need to take my phone my camera my money my id my makeup top up a little hairbrush maybe a little bottle of perfume do you know what i mean like the bits that you need and this is going to fit it all in there's literally a big pocket another pocket and then a front bit probably won't use like not very secure but the rest of it like oh my god that is item number one um in primer i may just got like little bits and bobs but like real essentials um so i picked up a because i have an electric toothbrush and i'm not going to take that with me because i don't know if i'm going to charge it and that kind of thing and whenever i do stay away i do tend just to get like a little disposable toothbrush um so i found this pack of five toothbrushes for 75p hold your horses 75p for five toothbrushes and i obviously will be using the pink one but i'm going to take the whole pack um because i'm staying with my friend lorna um and i messaged her and i was like honey don't worry about a toothbrush because i got plenty to go around so i'm going to obviously give her one or two or whatever she wants i'm going to take a bet that she's going to go for the purple one i'm going to take the pink and she knows that she won't have a say in that <laughs> um but i think she'll go with the purple i know that she likes lilac so yeah i just thought that was cute um and it yeah it's really cheap really handy and i can just throw it away once i finish with it like at the end of the holiday we're going for six nights by the way um then i got a mini micellar water just to take with me because obviously it's nice and small i'm not gonna have to take a massive one um just to take off my eye makeup and like makeup and stuff like that so got one of those um how much was this i actually don't know it doesn't have a price on it 90p what an absolute bargain um so yeah a little mini micellar water then i got my absolute going away essentials i bought these so many times this is the primark travel container like seven piece pack thing um just to put liquids in to be honest with you i have bought minis um but there's some things like my shower gel that i will Put into this and then like maybe i don't know an extra cream or something like that um but this was literally one pound and it's pink so i had to get it or you can get the white one but obviously we know the pink ones um you get a pump you get a spray you get a decant like a pory thing i don't know um another little pory one <laughs> a mini um can you see that like a little pot um and a funnel to put it back to obviously fill it all up in and obviously you get the bag which is really handy and then you get little stickers to put on it to let you know what's in it and stuff like that in case you forget so that was very handy it's only a pound i get that every time i go away and then i got some tweezers so just little like i mean i don't really know to be fair i do i do need new tweezers i don't need new tweezers but i have been wanting to get a pair of new tweezers for ages i should keep forgetting so i thought whilst i saw these super cute you get the really nice like mint blue or mint green i don't know what you'd call that um and some pink ones so i thought that was so cute to take away with me um i'm not gonna open them until we go i'm just gonna chuck them in my suitcase but that was one pound fifty for both of them bargain uh, then i got some cotton pads to take away with me for like makeup um 90p I don't need to talk about those. Um, oh my god, this was the best. Apart from that bag, the best thing that I honestly could have ever bought. Um, Ella spotted these and she was like, "Chia, you need them." Um, so I have obviously always gone to concerts and stuff really loud. You get the horrible ringing the day after when you get home, but you know it's fine. It goes within like a few hours, or whatever. But I had a traumatic experience when I saw Malevolence and Your Demise in December. Um, I had the most severe ear pain for like three days after that concert. And ever since then, I have worn earplugs and I feel like such a... I'm not even an elder emo, but like, do you know what I mean? Like an elder... Like it makes me a bit of a granny, but i had the biggest scare i literally thought i was got i had gone deaf like i couldn't hear anything for days i was gonna hear something but like it was so painful and so badly muffled that i was like oh my god have i damaged my eardrums um and that made me 
basically have a wake up call and think okay i cannot go to concerts anymore without earbuds especially like my loud like hardcore deathcore ones i can't go without earbuds so i bought some blue fender ones and they've been amazing i haven't had the pain since um but ella my gal ella she spotted pink ones and yes i know there's grey in the packet but molly's bought a pack as well and i'm going to give her my grey one she's going to give me her pink ones because that's just how we do it do you know what i mean sort your girls out um but can you see those oh, they are so perfect i don't i don't know if i'll take these with me because i don't feel like i'll need them it's not really like a, a concert it's more like a massive festival so i probably won't take them with me but i got them anyway just to use for concerts but they're literally pink perfect so that was those and they were only one pound my fender ones were like 12 pound um so yeah very pleased with that i'm just randomly pulling things out by the way um whatever comes out so next i got a black bikini um now primark bikini sizes or to be honest with you bikini sizes in general i really struggle with because i have a really small back but i have like a bigger boob sorry to anyone who's watching this that's like cheer we don't want to know about your boobs i'm letting you know um so i struggle with bikini tops i really really struggle and I, I never know what size sometimes i'll be a small sometimes i'll be a large it's like i don't know so i literally just have to it's just trial and error um and i feel like the bottoms are really hard to get as well because i like them to be really flattering on my bum like i don't want them to look like they're chopping my bum do you know what i mean um so i'm very fussy but all three of us got one of these black bikinis it was two pound for the bottoms two pound for the top um the top i got in a 12 and the bottoms i got in a 10 um i'm normally like a what well, i am like a size 8 so but then when i held up the size 8 to me it looked like it was made for like a 12 year old like that was never gonna fit so yeah i got the 12 in the top 10 in the bottoms um i've tried the bottoms on they fit but they're not the most flattering but i'm not gonna bother taking them back i'm still gonna take them with me because they were literally two pound and i might need like a spare um bikini bottom so i'm just gonna keep those but they're not gonna be like my go-to at all um but they'll do if i need it urgently or whatever and then the top i have tried on the top is absolutely perfect fits fine i am a 30 double d for any girls like who might be the same size as me who are like what do i get in primark bikini tops um get a 12 it fits me like really nicely looks really flattering i feel like it doesn't cover the whole boob spit to my i'm really sorry i don't like it to cover the whole boob i like it to have a little bit of like cleavage um just so that looks cute so yeah i got 12 and it literally fits like an absolute dream so that was good um i didn't see any other bikinis neither did ella and molly there really wasn't any in there so i've just ordered online um but i have a few things left so i got some hair bands and i was gonna get plain black ones but to be honest with you i have so many black hair bands i was like let me get some color so i got these they're just like a nice pack of pastel hair ties so obviously you get the the lilac or the purple the blue and the pink and i honestly thought that was so perfect only one pound fifty for 60 which is insane you do the maths i don't know what that is per hairband i don't know but it's pretty bloody cheap so i got those just to take with me so when i need to put my hair up around the pool or whatever um then i got oh i'm not going throwing things everywhere i got a luggage tag tag strap i got a luggage strap obviously a baby pink one it had to be didn't it um and you write your name and everything like that just a classic luggage strap one pound fifty so so happy with this um i have a black i think i'm hoping this is gonna fit my suitcase is really big so i'm actually looking at it now thinking is this gonna fit we'll make it fit if not you know we, we'll move it's only one pound fifty so you can't really lose and because my suitcase is black and literally looks like every other person's uh suitcase in heathrow gatwick luton every single airport you can imagine i don't want to be standing there for hours and then thinking is that my suitcase is that my suitcase so let's add a little personal touch a little bit of pink um make it easier to find so that i'm not causing lawn or loads of ads when i'm waiting to collect my stuff um then the last two things i got 
out again. Sorry if this is a bit weird showing camera, but I really don't care. Um, we're very open and honest on this channel. Um, so I got a three pack of the thongs. Now, Primark one pound thongs. Where have you gone? Every time we've gone into Primark, like I think I've gone like three times actually this year, maybe like four. Um, just to pop in. They don't have any of the one pound thongs. If they do, they literally will have like just the three packs. But I like the single ones that you can like pick different colours, kind of like pick a mix for your thongs. They've literally disappeared, I've not seen them in ages. Please tell me if it's just my Primark, um, because I literally ugh, I live and breathe in those. Um, but I did see these really cute three pack. So again, a little thong, I like a thong. Um, pink with red hearts and then a red one. And a pink one, I just thought that was so cute. And that's kind of my vibe for this holiday, it's bright, colour, colour blocking. Just fun, it's a festival, so we want to be, you know, we want to be looking fun. So yeah, that is those, they were £3 for three, so amazing. And then my last thing, and you guys know how much I love these sets, I think every single girl loves these sets, Um, the Primark £5 seamless set. I have pink, yellow, red, brown, black, purple. I think that's it um but i saw the baby blue one and i love it so much got it in a size small fits me perfectly so comfy little thong i feel like this is just nice for like comfies do you know what i mean just to go about my day um chilling in the room maybe like this with like a pair of joggers or shorts whatever um i just thought that would be very cute and yeah i just you can't really go wrong. Obviously, this was £5 um, for the set. I love these. They're so comfy. I'd highly recommend. They wash really well. Um, so, yeah, I just got a blue one of those. So, that was it for Primark. Sorry, I'm trying to get through this really quick because I have more than I actually realised. So, we went to Superdrug and originally I wasn't planning on doing my toiletries till like, way near the time because that's just so long. But we were there and I was like, you know what, I'll just get it whilst I'm here, get it out of the way. So we went to Super Drug and we all got our holiday toiletries. So this is all very boring, but I know that you'll want to see because you guys are just the most supportive, cutest pumpkins in the whole world. I love you dearly. And hopefully if you're going on holiday anytime soon, this will get you in the holiday mood. Um, and it might remind you what to bring because I forgot. I don't know about you, but where I've not been away in so long, I literally was like, what do I bring? what do i need um but i think i've got it down to a t so baby wipes i'm gonna be real with you guys this festival it basically runs from 1 to 11 p.m is the festival then from 11 p.m to like 3 a.m is like an after party and um, every day so i'm not gonna sit here and pretend that at half three in the morning i'm gonna be doing a full in-depth skincare regime I'm sorry. I mean, I will try. I will actually try because I know it's really bad just to take it off of a wipe. But sometimes there's another option because you just, you're just drunk, you're tired, and you want to go to sleep. Do you know what I mean? So I got some wipes. It is 64 wipes. I think it was like pound or something like that. Can't complain. Um, then I got some coconut dry shampoo because I just feel like throughout the day like the festival day it's going to be so hot and sweaty so my hair's going to get all gross and then i'm going to want it nice for the night like party so i was like i'll just get some dry shampoo it smells of coconut which is like holiday smell for me so perfect don't know how much that was the wipes for 99p the dry shampoo was 1.99 very cheap and um, then i got a pack of venus razors just a two pack with scented handles apparently i have no idea apparently the razors are scented i don't know why they would do that but why not then in super drug you've got like the holiday mini section and it's always three for two so i got three foot two. um i just got a mini max white toothpaste or colgate one and um, that'll do me for a week oh this is sort of falling it's a very chaotic video i do apologize um and then i just got my aussie 
Miracle Moist Mini Slender Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, I was gonna bring my full size shampoo and conditioner, but I was like, what is the point? Like, it's just extra weight, so I'd rather have that in like my DMs. My DMs gonna be very heavy. Um, but yeah, so I thought I'll just get some minis. And I could have just decanted it into my pots, but I didn't think of that at the time. Um, so I just thought, you know what, let's just get the minis nice and easy. Once it's finished, throw it away and you're all good to go. Um, then I won't talk about this because girls, you know, we don't need to discuss this. But I'm only joking, guys. Keeping clean is a very normal thing. And if we want to talk about what we use to keep ourselves clean, we can talk about what we use to keep ourselves clean. The important thing is that we are clean. So, yeah. Cleanliness. Then, I got some Bondi Sands lip balm. This is a wild strawberry one. And this is a sunscreen lip balm. So, perfecto. Because I've had lip filler. I need to protect my lips. And you need to protect your lips anyway. Because your lip skin is the same as your nipple skin and it's very sensitive so we've got one of those i think it was like four pound five pound um not 100 percent necessary because i could have just got a cheap one but it's strawberry i think the, please tell me the pot's actually pink i know what it is imagine that in my beach bag stunning um then i got some malibu um Factor 15 SPF bronzing tanning oil. Now, I am going to use actual proper sunscreen as well. Do not worry. This is only for when I'm tanning, which will probably be like two days out of the six. But Lorna's mum, bless her heart, has actually sorted us out for sun cream. Like, she's got loads, so she's going to give us those. Um, that's actual proper sunscreen. So don't panic, guys. Don't come for me. It's just when I'm tanning, okay? I want to be tanned. Um, and I will only use this when my skin is obviously like, it's got a base tan already. Do you know what I mean? Safe tanning. Then the last thing I got from Superdrug is sun after sun. Because when I've been out in the sun all day, um, I will cover myself in this, like just before I go to bed or whatever, like just whenever I can. And this smells so good. If I can actually get it open, has it got a sticker on it? No. Oh, fabulous. Oh. Take a whiff of that. Have a little whiff. Go on. You know you want to. Honestly, smells like an absolute dream. I cannot wait to cover my body in that. Um, the best after sun. It's the Hawaiian Tropic After Sun Body Butter in Exotic Coconut. Woo! Can't bloody wait. And I got Molly to get that as well. Because I said to her, I was like, you need it. It smells nice. You've got to look after your skin. It's got aloe vera in it. Yay for Hawaiian Tropic after some. So that is what I got from Primark and Superdrug. That's what we got, obviously, when we went shopping last week. Um, but I have a really small Opoly and Pretty Little Thing parcel to quickly show you. And then I will end this video because I can see it's very long already. I really don't want to bore you guys. Um, but Opoly. So... We basically need daytime festival outfits and then nighttime like party outfits. But I'm kind of going like rave style. I'm not a raver at all. I've been to a rave in my life. But that kind of vibe. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I'm trying to say? But like a cool girl rave. I'm very aware that I'm literally the most uncool person in the world. But it's fine. Um, we can pretend. So got a little cold from my poly so is this the top of the skirt honey so this is the skirt this is going to be for one of the evenings like the night time party situation um so we have a blue mini skirt very cute and then i'm gonna actually put a picture here or here i'm not sure of the outfit on the model so you can actually see because you're not going to be able to tell what this is like when i show you the top it's like loads of bits everywhere um i'll just put a picture up so you can see so then it's like the little ah that's the bralette and then you've kind of got this like mesh situation that goes around it i'm not even gonna bother showing you because i literally like what does that mean? 
um, that shows nothing. So yeah, I will put a picture on the screen. Um, but I've got both of those in a 10, I believe. Sorry, my phone's literally going off. Yeah, I got it in a 10 because Opoly on me comes up so small. And I feel like sometimes Opoly can be a little bit guilty of not considering us girls who are slim, but we have boobs and a bum. Um, so Opoly, if you could please help a girl out and give a little bit more material because otherwise my boobs are going to be like, Ugh. do you know what I mean? But this fits really well. It does look quite booby, but it's classy booby, so it's fine. Um, but yeah, that is one of my evening outfits sorted. And then, um, from PLT, I ordered, um, oh, there's stuff everywhere, Chia. I just ordered a, it's not even, it's literally come untied, but very plain basic baby pink bikini just a normal triangle triangle bikini um i got the top in a 10 the bottoms in a 10 also i have tried this on fits fine absolutely fine this was like seven pound fifty for both um so really really cheap perfect so i will be wearing that so i thought on top of that bikini i could wear this so i got this from plt also um, it's just like a, and she, I can't remember what the model was wearing it with, but like crop top and cycling shorts. But I'm going to chuck this over my bikini. It's a really nice, thin, like holiday material. That's the only way I can describe it. Um, so it's perfect. It's really light, like it's really airy. It's not hot. Um, and I got this in a size eight, but it is extremely oversized. So I kind of wish I got a six, but um i'd rather it be oversized than not i'm really sorry this is really rude of me i'm gonna put my phone on silent um so yeah just like a little shirt very casual that's the sleeves the bottom's just normal um so i thought that with that bikini with like my pink ed hardy hat and my pink beach bag and some sort of sandals would look super cute so i got that and then for the for like beach cover up i got this um sorry that just something flew in front of the camera um it's like a i don't really know what it's like a beach, yeah it just is a beach cover up there's no other way to describe it so i'm not very good at words today as you can tell um but it's it's obviously see-through um can you see my hand yeah there you go so it is see-through so it is literally to go on top of the bikini and um, but i thought i could get maybe like a lilac bikini to go under this i thought that would look cute it would look nice with a baby pink but i prefer the baby pink with the shirt so i might get like a lilac bikini very lilac at the moment what's going on um but yeah that's really cute again from plt it's got really nice like scalloped edge really pretty same with the sleeves and the neckline i've tried this on fits like a dream absolutely fine um maybe with like maybe a bandana not really sure um but definitely bikini underneath sandals and yeah very cute so that was what i got from oh no i got one more thing from plt now don't judge me okay for that blue outfit I'm t i told you i'm going a bit ravey to go with the blue outfit. Ince, 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 ince. These blue sunnies. And these are actually from the Alabama Barker collection. Um, Travis Barker's daughter. It's from her collection with PRT. So, obsessed with these. Um, I think they were like four or five pounds, something like that. I can't remember. Really cheap. Um, no, these are not going to be my everyday sunglasses, very clearly clearly get it that's a good one um i'm gonna wear these with that blue set maybe like a braid or like braids and then down hair and my dms so i thought that was a really cute outfit um so yeah i got those from plt and i just remember i actually got two things from asos um so i'll show you those but these are like it's like boring but not boring by the way i will link everything that i can possibly link down below obviously i can't link primark stuff and superdrug stuff but the rest of it i will link for you so if you know my love for sol de janeiro body stuff then you know um this is the bum bum cream the famous bum bum cream i have a small one 
um but i wanted to get another one i thought i'll get the big one um for holiday because i want to smell like this the whole holiday and then i got the matching body spray again i got the big one because i know that i'm so obsessed with this smell there's no point me getting the small one it'll run out and i'll be sad i want to get another one so i might as well get the big one um literally it's it's pistachio and salted caramel which is what the fragrance is but i cannot explain to you the smell of this stuff like it is heavenly it's so nice um so i got those i literally just got the biggest tub of this and it's not the cheapest stuff but i would never ever order it without a discount code on like look fantastic or asos and asos had 20 percent off so i just got it there and then i'm just gonna have a little whiff like i just can't even i'm probably not gonna take a perfume on holiday with me because this smells so strong i won't need one um and i feel like when i wear this i like to wear it without a perfume because otherwise a perfume takes away the smell a bit so i'm just gonna wear this with the body spray um and i'll spray this on my clothes and stuff so yeah perfect combo obviously it's the same smell um apparently it's pronounced bum bum cream not bum bum cream but i say bum bum cream because i think it sounds cuter um so that was those got from asos we'll link it down below if you haven't smelt those please smell them um i've got ella and molly hooked on it molly's actually ordered she we, they, they both ordered the bum bum cream and now molly's ordered the shampoo the conditioner the deodorant like once you smell this smell you will never ever ever want to smell like anything else especially in summer so bum bum cream so my pumpkins that is the end of this haul i really hope this isn't really long and dragged out i feel like i did try to get through it quite quickly but i'm really sorry if i didn't <laughs> um but yeah i hope you liked everything that i got any questions any whatever just let me know um let me know what you guys liked let me know if you're going on holiday soon i would love to know where you're going um because i just love talking about holidays i'm so excited so i will love and leave you but i will see you in the next video literally so loud outside um i have got my windows open if you can hear weird noises so yeah i am just really excited to go away now um i can't wait to use all this stuff i'm literally just keeping it in my suitcase for now so that i haven't got to put it away and then get it back out i'm just gonna put it all in my suitcase so when i pack it's there for me to pack um, but I don't know what the next video is going to be, but you know, stick around and you'll see. I'm in a good mood today because I've got a really exciting meeting this afternoon, so, so I'm in a really good mood. Um, but yeah, I love you all pumpkins. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in the next one, um, whenever that is, but it won't be long. And make sure you follow me on Instagram, TikTok, everything to keep up with my days with their life, if that's what you want to do. Um... But yeah, I'll link everything I possibly can below and thank you for watching the haul. Hope you enjoyed. Bye pumpkins. Have the best week. I love you all so much. Bye.